three for me, I'm going to ask a nice loud voice. Put. Statement. Okay, so this one, it's saying put an X. Can you show me an X? What does an X look like? Yes, it looks like that. In other words, it's a cross. Put an X next to the correct statement. We had this yesterday. What does correct mean? Mm, what does it mean? Correct means like something like you get correct. What is it? Though? Like, like, like if I don't know nobody's name, but I try to think, then I might get it correct. <laughs> yes, you might. And another word for it, well done, is? It's right. It's right. So correct means thumbs up, doesn't it? And incorrect means thumbs down. So put an X next to the correct, it's the right, right statement. Here is the statement. Okay. Number one, B has a greater volume than A. Maybe. There's B, there's A. Number two, the jugs have an equal volume. What does equal mean? What does equal mean? Yes. The same. Yes, good girl. The jugs have an equal volume. Hmm. So which statement is correct? Let's go again. B has a greater volume than A. Is that right or is that wrong? Right. You think that's right? What do you think? You're not sure? You're not sure? What do you think? You think it's right. Okay, well, let's double check. The jugs have an equal volume. Now, does that look equal to you? Does it look the same? No. I don't think so, because A, how could you describe A? How could you describe A using the language that we've done? Is it half full? Is it nearly full? What is it? What is it? Half. It's half full. It's a bit less than half full, I think, isn't it? So we think that one is a bit less than half full. How could we describe this one? Yes. I think in that one it's nearly, nearly full. Yeah, it's almost full, nearly full, isn't it? I think it is full actually. So this is half full and this one is nearly full. So which has the greatest, the greatest? Which has the most, Ashley? Which has the most? That one. Which one, A or B? B. B. So are we going to tick? Oh, no, we're not going to tick. We're going to put an X. Are we going to put X for number one or number two? Uh, Alex. Which one? Are we going to put an X here or an X here? Let's phone a friend. Do we know? Which one? Number one or number two? Number one. Number one. Well done. Because it has the greater volume. All right, so you're going to put an X in number one. Oh.